Is another first? Must be all this talk of man is making her feel all wifely. Play a drink? Ah, uh, I'm all right, dear. You sure about that? Yeah, I'm getting around in. I'm not talking about the drinks. Only you never said out one of the doctors. Oh, it's all right. And? Oh, I'm in fine battle. But thanks for asking. Cut. Yeah. Could I have a round for a lot over here when you got the time? Thing. You took me afternoon off special and all. Yeah, but there's loads of chores that I've got to be doing. Hey, you better take note, my dear. That is how I expect you to be here when we get married. Oh, two hopes, Mr. Truman. None and none at all. <laughs> so, you going to tell me what the doctor really said? I told you earlier. Fit as a fiddle. Now look me in the eye and say that. Well, maybe they was a bit concerned. Not just a bit. Look, Dot, I'm not going to tell anyone. I've been referred. I got an appointment at the hospital on Friday afternoon. I knew it. No, it's just routine. And I don't want nobody making a fuss about it. It's nothing. I mean, I'd be the first to tell everybody, wouldn't I? And what's Jim saying about it? He don't know. Why not? Because there's no point in him worrying about nothing. All the same, you should tell him. I am perfectly fine. Listen, you've been good to me in the past. Now, don't think I'm not going to be the same back, all right? You're better than your father. Don't let nobody tell you different. I've got my eye on you, Doc. <laughs> 